I know what you're thinking. Obviously, the crotch man forgot how this tango went down in the last game. 
I'd barely gotten the stinky ball suit on when the teabag's phone rang. It was the gay rodeo pit boss calling to remind Crotchy he was late for the rodeo. All the little gay children would cry if Kay didn't show. Plus, it was a paying gig, so the hunt for champ would have to wait. Ooh, I love the rodeo. Yeah, it was swell. Okay, village people, cowboy. This is what you'll be barebacking today. I couldn't find any bulls, but I got just something better. Ooh, interesting. There's definitely something I like about it, but I can't put my finger in it. Okay, little oppressed cow brother, you're gonna wage animal jihad on behalf of all your little oppressed bovine friends with the help of a little methamphetamine. Guys, we'll need a distraction while I prepare our little friend for battle. Hey, mascot, you're late. Your job is to amuse the kids and clean up the shit and condoms, and no kids showed up today. So get to it, scrotum. Have a crotchy fucking day. of the rodeo mascot was to pick up cow and homo droppings. Since there were no cattle in sight, I tried not to think about where all the feces were coming from. Oh no, not again. I guess I should choose a sign. Decisions, decisions.
with enough meth for an entire elementary school. It was Gonzo Shitball's Berserker, and it had a sweet tooth for the pit boss. I knew if I wanted to get paid, I'd have to save his fat ass. I noticed it couldn't turn too quickly, and figured maybe I could piss it off and make it run into stuff until it got tired and peacefully fell asleep. It's gonna leave a mark. That's not going on my permanent record. Oh my Oh, 
close enough. So, the pit boss reveals he's really the mayor in another shitty disguise. Anyway, he lost his wallet in the chaos and can't pay. That ball sack didn't transfer the plutonium, but I've successfully infiltrated the mayor's operation. We'll finish the scenario in his speech later today. My gang's running security at the event. What? What's so funny? No, what happened at Altamont? starting to get a little depressed. I've been walking around in that sweaty fucking crotchy suit all day and still no sign of the champ. Trust me, you do not want to know the inside of that suit stuff. But then I almost stepped in a huge pile of dog shit full of that fake payday loan guy's blood. Champ had left me a breadcrumb trail. The trail of poo ended at the secret passage to an underground lair. I wasn't surprised at all to discover that the Mexi sushi boys were involved. Sayonara, rancid fucking scrotum suit. Aloha, rancid fucking sewer level. I better not see any crates down here or I swear some level designer's gonna get shanked. Give me a bailout! I blame Glenn Beck. Hey, pal. Give me some bucks or I'll follow you home. Hey man, I've walked and died in the NAM for your right to give me some fucking change. Yo, Bill Gates, you got a spare change? Hey Obama, give me a bell out. Helper monkey, go get me a beer. You suck. Actually, a very nice person. I'll use this! I will! 
recognize you gonna be picking busy you wheel off the sidewalk, son. Don't worry, it's just like sleeping. Sushi dirt bags were storing their secret ingredients down there. I could hear someone talking and discovered our old friend Al was secretly the owner of the place. The double dealing bastard was actually reselling the cosmetics lab its own liberated test animals. But I wasn't the only one annoyed at this cheesy plot twist. Champ was apparently running his own rescue mission. and our retreat was blocked. But it didn't matter. Champ had more friends that needed rescuing. What sauce?
I bet you thought you weren't going to die today. Surprise! You know, I never found myself in situations like this back when I smoked chronic every day. Stay the fuck away from me! I mean... I blame the feel like shit. Only my weapon understands me. Trust me, you never want to be this close to monkey diapers. the death panel. Don't kill people. I You don't want to know what I'm capable of. I blame the lamestream media. 
Also that other media. These physics are better. Don't crowd. 
There's plenty for everyone. Flavor crystals. Champ and I emerged victorious from the smelly underbelly of old catharsis. Dozens of half maimed little kitties and monkeys in our wake. Yo, Crotchy phone. Crotchy, where the fuck is the mayor's plutonium shipment? You wouldn't like him when he's mad. Plutonium? What you talking about? Plutonium? Dude, is that you? Hey, Dave. Crotchy is er, indisposed at the moment. Can I help you? Those toys, you know. The glowy crotchy figures that explode on contact? They're filled with plutonium. Can you bring them to me? There's cash money in it for you. Oh, yeah. Like hell I was going to give away my favorite... Er, I mean, I, it would have been immoral to allow an obvious madman to get his hands on weapons-grade plutonium. So I decided to improvise. All right. That plutonium... I'll bring it right over, man. Okay, so now things get complicated. I arrived at Uncle Dave's theme park and delivered the plutonium. Well, I didn't think plutonium would look so much like a bottle of piss. Dave was so happy he hired me to run the visuals for the mayor's big presidential announcement. But some idiot makes up the tapes, and I accidentally ran a somewhat compromising piece of video. It featured, among other things, the mayor and Dave performing illicit acts with his 40-year-old Malaysian slave boy and a rhino. 
there's been a terrible mistake. That video is a plot by the elite liberal media conspiracy. Dave, make it stop! I hope I didn't catch you at a bad time, but either you can pay up for all that plutonium I sent you, or I will reclaim this amusement park in the name of Allah. Capish? Security! Sorry, Dave, but you're all under arrest by the vaguely defined authority of my nebulous government agency. You have the right to detention in our secret prison. You have the right to enhanced interrogation. You have the right to tell us everything you know, you terrorist douche tards. Yeah, bitches. Assume the position. Fuck this shit. I'm out of here. I'm with you, man. Don't leave me. Good plan. Come on, champ. Let's bear.
Kucher, and you've just been pumped.
shit, that fucking hurt! I know this looks bad, but I'm actually a very nice person. thought he was going to arm his homebrew nuke before the hockey moms got him, but that didn't really work out. Endless hockey moms, like a plague of infidel zombies. We're boned. What are we going to do, David Einstein? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to drink this fucking plutonium before those bitches tear my dick off. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Stupid infidel! Now all our dicks are forfeit! And so, having battled heroically for justice, liberty, and all the little kittens and retards, I emerged from that shithole victorious. And of course, by now, everyone knows the reception I got. Irony is a bitch. Wow. I am at a loss for words, Mr. Dude. I know. It's tragic. A heartbreaking tale of injustice. Actually, according to our records, it's also pretty much complete bullshit, Mr. Dude. Crap. Well, I had to try. I suppose. Obviously, I have no choice but to send you to your very just and quite eternal damnation. Sorry, I'd say better luck next time, but we don't believe in that Buddhist shit. I regret nothing! 